In this fourth video tutorial, we're going to take a look at a tool known as I'm Feeling Lucky in the online Google Earth. It appears here, the icon appears to be a set of dice, and when the students click on this tool, they are taken randomly to a location on Google Earth. The same information card that we've seen previously uh, as we explored the tools loads in the upper right hand corner. If students click on the picture, they get an entire page of information about this location. Information, did you know, and then similar places that they could search for as well. In addition, there's the Wikipedia link here, and then the option to simply look at what people would also explore, which would allow them to open here as additional information cards that the students can scroll through while staying here on the Google Earth site. If they wanted to visit one of these locations instead, they could click on it, and then when the information card loads, they can select it from underneath and be taken to that location in addition to the first. Similarly, if they click on the image, when the expanded page loads, if they click the image again, they get the image in full screen with the entire slide deck or slideshow available, and they can scroll through by clicking on the arrows that appear on the left and right to see all of the different images available for this location. Students can also use all of their standard Google Earth tools while exploring something in the I'm Feeling Lucky. For example, they can scroll in and out and click and drag to see nearby places to the location that they were flown to. They can use the 2D and 3D to get a different perspective of their location and, of course, pick up Pegman to see if there's any street view imagery available for their location. And finally, as a suggestion for how students can explore their location better, don't forget in the menu the ability to turn on photos to see additional images that may be available around this location. So how could students use the I'm Feeling Lucky tool in class as a part of instruction? Well, Google on their Google Earth Education page has some resources and ideas for how students can use a passport activity in social studies, English language arts, math, and geography class as well. And then just as an example, I've expanded the social studies passport lesson here. So it, this has a lesson plan for the teachers to follow, as well as resources to share with students. And basically the idea is students would create a passport and use the I'm Feeling Lucky tool periodically throughout the school year to visit a variety of locations all while practicing their writing skills to take notes about the location or their research skills to follow up with additional information about the location after visiting it on Google Earth. So creating that passport for students is also an easy thing that has been managed for teachers. There are templates available in Google Slides for students to create a passport, including filling in a variety of countries they may have visited through an application like Google Earth. And then also our Wixi account has passports available for students as well that they simply need to fill in and customize for their own project. And that's the I'm Feeling Lucky tool.